Hey, what's up, guys? My name's Emma, and today I'll be reacting to Volume 9, Chapter 3 of Ruby. Um, this is the 15,000th time I've started this. I'm recording it two ways, one for BitChute, that link down below, or if you're on BitChute, hopefully I'll remember to put the YouTube link. Just know that BitChute always gets uploaded first, generally speaking, so go there around, like, Sunday, uh, Sunday, Monday. Uh, YouTube will be Monday or Tuesday. One of those two. Now that I've got that out of the way, uh, I'm, I need a new PC straight up. That's why I'm having issues. But we're going to jump into this um, right about now because I'm just excited. So on the count of three, two, one, now. Oh, never mind, buffered. We are at, yeah, yeah, it, it just reset. We're good. Anyways. Oh. This is the last time. I, I keep stalling it. Just I need to accept it for what it is. <laughs> last time I got upset because I, I just rambled too much. I, I didn't talk enough about uh, last episode. So I decided to just cut my reaction. Sorry for the light on my face, by the way. Uh, it was sunny earlier, like an hour or two ago when I first started trying to record. But now it's cloudy. Because it's for rain. Um, but... Um, last time was a bit of a emotional everything, uh, and I know, I, I feel like my reaction is really diminished from, like, how much I focus on Ruby, which I'm not gonna say, I, I'm not promising that I will not <laughs> be biased towards Ruby, um, I feel like she's a very big part of, like, what's gonna be happening, um, but I, I, I will, like, try to point out how how much I really appreciate everyone else in the background too, because they are st they're there. I'm not blind to it. I loved everything about Weiss last chapter, from her like animate reactions in the back when she just goes in is like a mood, the throwing of the rock, which I swear I reacted to more, but watching it back, I feel like I didn't. <laughs> but yeah, no. Finding Penny's weapon, getting Yang's arm back, and now inviting ourselves to the birthday party by using Penny's weapon as a, I'm not saying tool, but just as a way to get in. That is where we're at. So, here's to helping things go good. Sorry, I have to turn the audio up. Uh, are we sure we should Hoping I didn't this? make it too, too well, loud, but... We aren't Alex. You're uh, you're not, but Alex would probably be here, right? So I don't want it to be too loud on this side, but oh, it's it's the king. Um, You're hello the there. King? Yep. Duh! How dare you! There is no king. I am the Red Prince. The Red Why Prince, I'm okay. Coming to someone's Sorry, castle I'm looking without at my even knowing who they are. And on my birthday! Happy birthday, Your Majesty! Happy birthday, Your Majesty! Yes, all of us, we need to pay attention. This this, yes, this yes, one here seems a little crazy. Thank you very much. Red Prince? The king wasn't nearly as rude. Or small. <gasps> or loud. Well, if it hadn't been for your kind, the king would still be here. Ah! Happy birthday, your majesty. <sighs> Happy oh, birthday. birthday, I guess. Yay and white. Uh, you said it, they said happy birthday, and there's signs. Uh, there's a lot of things that give away that it's your birthday. You just told us. Also, we saw advertisements for your party. Everywhere. You are in the presence of royalty. That's me, thank you very much. The heir to the Crimson Castle. Yeah, this prince is quite annoying, I will admit. Did I used to be unbearably pompous? 
A little less. Close, though, Wise. You were getting close. Actually, Iffy. Wise's context was a little different. No help at all. Yeah, no help at all. Isn't the weapon like his size, if not taller? I kind of want to see it. I'm just like green. Oh, and you kick. Oh, you guys are gonna fucking break, Ruby. Oh, they kill him. They straight up kill them. Okay then. Um. No wait. Well, maybe we can help cheer you up. Oh, Ruby's trying so hard. People does cheer me up, but no. Go on. No beheading. We people. heard you like to play games. Okay. We're in a dangerous spot, but yeah. But no, how dare he kick Pen Penny's sword. <laughs> but also... I don't know. I, I want to say good on Ruby for keeping so composed in this situation, but... I'm also so distraught for her. So, what exactly but what did they mean by that? Me? If, if it weren't for you, the game. king would still be There's here. Always a catch. Is what I want to know. Majesty. You are as wise as you are. Uh, oh. Charming. Small. <sighs> Thank you. Yes. You appreciate if it. We win, we'll take it. Our only request is that you help us get to the tree. The tree? It's so far away. That's a why we're asking. Hmm. I feel like something's gonna go horrendously I wrong. Help you with what you ask. Oh, great. So, uh, how do we play? This looks so morbid. I'm oh, sorry. Every pawn, one space each turn. A rule okay. two. Whoever gets the most pawns to the other side of the board wins. A rule three. To take over a space, you must dispose of whoever occupies it. Dispose of? Oh, okay. Sorry, buffering's occurring. Ah. Oh, I'll have to fix this and edit. Hold up. Okay. Okay, we should hopefully be good. Poor YouTube person's gonna be so uh, okay. um, iffy. Oh, I these poor pawns. Pieces. It would make sense. Are you? Like, How perfect that you brought along friends to fuck play you. in. Fuck you! I'm gonna fight you. I'm gonna fight you right now. Oh my god. I guess these are our teammates. Yeah, they are. For better or worse. Right? You saw him decapitate two people. As I am a gracious ruler. The white team may go first. Yep, he didn't promise. Oh, I'm gonna be so mad. So so mad. Holy shit. Uh, can you advance? 
dance one space forward, please? Play dead. <laughs> A victory for me. He's rigging this shit. Oh my god, did he freeze again? Oh, being carried off in a stretcher. Oh, it's just, it's just buffering galore. Yeah. Okay, how about you three? Every time. Oh, they're all down. All three down. Instant. Oh. Weiss, do you think you can take that space? Have some faith! Haha! Yeah, uh, beginner's luck. Yep. It doesn't bother me. <laughs> Have fun. <laughs> so, tell me. Oh, is he gonna get into her head? To to the tree? We want to go home, and we believe the tree can get us there. Gang, you're up. All over it. You, like almost don't. Well, you have to get as many pawns over. But if, but clearing, uh, sending the R3 in is better to clear space, maybe? I don't know. He can still technically get the pawns, and but... how do you know this? Well, it worked for someone we know. Uh, Blake, your turn. Here we go. Oh my god, you two are precious. <laughs> Someone you know. Hmm? Hey, hey, what about us? What do you want us to do? Huh? Enough! It's my turn! Attack! Fall in my head! Help them out. Oh my god, did they gain hope? I want these white pieces to gain hope because they've no, been battered. We can this see it. Is not how it's supposed to go. This isn't right. This isn't fair. What's not fair? You, you mean kind of like what you were doing? Like, you, you can't be what mad that they're just playing what the type same of game. Creatures did you say you are again? Uh. Well, uh. Blake is a faunus. Little's a mouse. At least I think. Sure. Sure. And the rest of us are humans. Human? <gasps> the cat. The cat. That was definitely the wrong response. That was the wrong response. Human? Yep, yep, we're doomed. I knew it! You must have cheated! All of you! Get them! Get them! How? I need. We don't know the backs. Why would them immediately mention human? It, it must tie back to the statement about the king, right? Oh my god, it's this music from the trailer. Oh, this is a pain to edit, but I love this. Come on, guys! Even the white pieces are going to get. It's a song! Hold up, I have to turn it down a bit, but... It might not have done anything, but... <laughs> it did stuff for me. I don't give a F if it's your royal birthday. I'm not letting you hurt people. Come on, Radith. I know I would be kind of... I don't know. I want Ruby to, like, kind of just swap them because she has the ability, but I don't know if that's... She might just have to, though. Things are getting bad. Uh, unlike this king, I kind of... We, we do kind of want... Oh, she ran out of ammo. Oh, do you know if you can... No! Ruby. Ruby. Oh. Oh. 
I need to listen to this on repeat. Is this what the lag was? <laughs> Wings. I know, I want no more buffering, but I'll accept it for how epic this was. Teamwork! Let's go! Let's go! This is why I wanted the camera, because I'm so, so animated. Yeah, you were saying? Is it checkmate? And you threw them! Come on, Ruby, catch them, catch them! Fucking shit, Blake almost fell. Shoot, it's only Ruby who's- oh, it's a cat! Okay, what, what's the cat gonna do here? to do the one thing you were put on this acre to do. I understand. Surely you don't want to behead them. They are but fragile things without a head. If you get angry and break them, they might not ever come back. <laughs> they won't. It's my birthday! I don't care! They wouldn't let me. I know, Your Majesty. It truly isn't fair. You must play your game and win at any cost. It must hurt your heart. Let me help. Oh, purring. Purring. I won't behead them. If I ever want to see them again! God, he's so whiny. <laughs> what about my friends? They're still tiny. And he promised he would- are like birds. They taste great, but always escape. You should go before he changes his mind. Don't touch me! Come quickly. Sorry, I heard John touch me and I thought about uh, volume two. Twice, when they're playing the board game. Okay, Ruby's the only full-size person right now. Oh, that's so trippy. They were running sideways? Yeah, they were. I don't know how that went so wrong. But thank you for saving us. Good thing I dropped by the prince's party when I did. I usually hate parties. How did you end up in his game anyway? We wanted to speak to the Red King, but he wasn't there. And now we're back where we started. The king? How do you know him? Information, okay. Well, times change, you know, and so do we when it's our time to change. Mm. Don't you? Hmm. Okay. Did you hear that? There was a Red King. Right. But something's changed since then. Great! So we're not in the stupid story after all. We're in its stupid sequel. <laughs> it's sequel! First thing Even better. First, what are you? What did you need to talk to the king about? And what is your favorite dessert? <sighs> what, again? We're humans. Well, and... I must say, you're not nearly as interesting as the others I've met. What others? About... <gasps> Hold that thought. What's the deal with this cat? Can't anyone here be normal? That's not just any cat. When Alex was lost, she met the curious cat. It's a curious cat. Ask questions. And the curious cat helped Alex find the tree. Wait, so the cat is our ticket out of here? Proves! Don't let that cat get away! Cat! Play cat! Oh, goodness. Can you do that? <laughs> so much energy coming from Little there. I can feel how much it's affected Little. Oh! Light and darkness. Kind of oh, it's where this creature came from. Oh, ugh, duh. was that it cutting itself on the plant? Sorry, God. Um, Neo lands here. Oh my. 
Oh, and she's pissed. I'm pissed at you, girl. Oh, you're transformed into Cinder. Are we gonna get to see her fight it? Or... Um... Oh, hell no. Why are there so many copies of Neo? Oh, no. Is she gonna have, like, an army? It, is that what I'm seeing? Like, if, the, if that's the case, like, that's just cheating. <laughs> to have that many support factors into this, that that is just not fair. That is beyond cheap, okay? I'm calling it. It's cheap. Also, I, I'm upset it's over, but I, 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 because of technical difficulties, I actually saw the ending coming instead of, uh you know, being so sucked into it and invested that I didn't realize 17 minutes had gone by. <laughs> so. That song sounded great. I'm definitely going to be going back to it, but in for now, I'm just going to briefly talk about this for YouTube. And if you want a, hopefully, a little bit more in-depth uh, conversation, we will just go to BitChute. Okay, just give me a second. Okay. Um, but yeah, no, uh, this episode was great. I loved it a lot. It's interesting because from the beginning, it seemed like all of them were kind of playing a part as Alex's role from the book. So discovering that something happened to the king and I swear one of the guards, uh, I'll try going back to it for the bitch shoot one, but I'm just going to theorize right here. The guards, I swear, mentioned that the king was gone because of their kind or something like that when referring to Ruby and company. So I kind of, I'm very curious about where that's coming from and what's that going to mean for the cast. You know, very, very interested. Um, and then just... Ruby's still going through it, and while I'm so, I'm commending her for being able to still keep going and, like, trying to push through it, even with all of the adversity and all of, like, the pain she's currently going through, I also am scared about that. Because she's pushing through so much, and she already didn't have time to go really through realizing and discovering that Penny's dead. And, you know, you have the king just kicking the weapon, throwing it away simply because he doesn't like green. You have the, well, I say king, you know, prince. And then you go into the game where you get a promise. But because you won, and this prince is all about it's his birthday, he gets to win. So he throws a fit and you just say that you're human. And now all of a sudden you're the enemy and your friends are all tiny. It's a lot. It's just so much. Um... It, and because she wanted to go to the to see the king, yes, every, like Blake was super on it too because you know she's very in the know of the book. She really is conscientious of it. Ruby was the one who was like, "Take us to take us to the birthday party." So I, I feel like that might be something she holds on her mind again, and I really don't want her to do that. She she needs someone to safely give her that minute to breathe but I feel like if someone tries doing that in this situation right now she'll Ruby might take offense or she might feel like she's useless or only causes trouble so I'm really scared about that um but it, you know I love how everyone is very in tune with uh the goings and like you know we had volume eight where everyone was so torn like the group uh, over different things, and it was split. But seeing here where they're trusting each other and, like, still wanting to give it a shot and not just kind of pushing it off, 
And while the pat, like what just happened is still affecting how they're reacting and what they're thinking about, all of them are actually doing pretty amazing if you think about it when it comes to how they haven't kind of just shut down and I just I can only commend them for that I I love Ruby and I love everyone in it you know except for the villains uh they can be good villains but if you're a good villain that means I personally hate you because you were written so good I don't like you <laughs> but yeah um Neo's our army thing, I don't know. That that's gonna be a huge issue we're gonna have to deal with. But anyways, so I can actually go into the discussion and not make the bit shoot video longer than it already is going to be because of technical difficulties. I'm gonna end off this YouTube by saying, I hope you all enjoyed. Let me know your thoughts, uh and theories behind all this. Um if yeah, if you have theories, I I'm willing to hear. I was gonna say maybe not, because who knows, but no, I, I'm open to hearing theories. Um, I'm going to avoid watching people's videos on theories, but you know, if you guys have theories personally, let me know. Uh, I'll try my best to a work with the fact that this, uh, buffered into oblivion, um, while also just making sure the next one comes out a little bit better. Same for the bit shoot one. So, you know, y you'll, you'll know the technical difficulties and issues I had over there, but it is what it is. But I hope you have a great day or night. Whenever thank you for watching this, and I'll see you all later. Bye-bye.